I just heard a loud boom. And it, it just happened so fast, I didn't even have time to react to that. Janiyah Peterson is talking about this frightening scene at the 7-Eleven on Cook Street in Waterbury Monday night. Take a look at what happened to her. She was standing at the counter when this SUV slammed into the store and almost ran her over. Peterson didn't know how close of a call it actually was until we showed her the surveillance video. It turns out she was planning to check out at the register where the car eventually crashed, and she changed her mind at the last second. I think I'm very lucky. Maybe my angels are looking over me because after seeing that video, I, it's hard to watch. She said she was buying a lotto ticket when suspected drunk driver Kennedy Dowdell plowed through this place and struck her in the back. I just know I felt that sharp pain and I kind of got pushed up against the register. But the threat wasn't over. She jumped on the counter to get out of harm's way when Dowdell put this SUV in reverse and backed out of the store. I'm pretty mad because I would never in a million years imagine that would happen to me. Waterbury police tracked down Dowdell a short time later here on Hill Street. They say he admitted to being drunk and that he took off because he was scared. Any questions? No questions. On Tuesday afternoon, Dowdell faced a judge where he was charged in connection to the crime, and his lawyer spoke out in his defense. Within the last year, I just got back from serving two tours, one in Iraq and one in Afghanistan. I think at the end of the day, what you're going to see here is that young men sometimes make mistakes. A possible mistake that sent Janiyah Peterson to the hospital. I'm just happy to be alive. I don't want to cry.